that warms your heart. Oh, what a horse she is. She's just an absolute marvel. Just loves racing. When you think uh, you've seen everything with her, there's more to come. Like, they went quick today. Yeah. She just traveled, just got there so easily. And when, when she quickened, she was just different class today. Uh, I think she just keep getting better. Uh, the more she races, the better she is. Yeah. She's just full of confidence, just loving life right now. That might have been her easiest win today. Uh, like to the eye, it was, yeah. Uh, especially against uh, those kind of horses. And the way she did it, she was, yeah, like she was clear. And I'm sure there was plenty more left. Uh, yeah, like she, she's been a great horse for this table. Uh, credit to the team. Like she's been everywhere. Uh, Miss Prep, obviously, she's been up here. She spent some time at the beach. She's been at Bong Bong between runs. Uh, yeah, we've got great facilities, great team of people, and yeah, that's credit to them. Not only has she got 20 million in the bank, she's got plenty of frequent flyer points as well. Uh, she, she does, she does, and she loves travelling. <laughs> I think she, she loves travelling more than anyone else, and she's travelled more than me the uh, last couple of years. But uh, yeah, great. It's a uh, great bunch of owners. Obviously, they've had a lot of fun with her, and the fact she keeps doing it, uh, that's, I think that's the impressive part. I think Craig Williams and Bella Nipatina are like a hand in a glove. Oh, very much so. He just gets on so well with her. He knows her better than anyone else. And he just rides her uh, better than anyone else, but he knows exactly how, what he can do and what he can't with her. Yep. And yeah, they're just very, uh, they're very good association together. And obviously, I'm sure she loves him as much as he loves her. Do you think Kieran will put her away now? Do you think that's it? Can she do any more right now? She could do any more, but she could do more, but I'm not sure that would be the right thing to do. But saying that, if, if she comes uh, through that run and she's jumping around like she has been uh, a couple of days after runs, obviously you might have to rethink that. But uh, yeah, I think she's done, she's done a very good job this prep. Uh, yeah, she, she's earned, uh, well, uh, a good rest. You can uh, just set your sights on another Everest uh, next year, you've got 12 months to plan. I think that's the plan, isn't it? Uh, oh, it's obviously a race is always a target, but if she if she improves uh, between this year and next year, like she did from last year, yeah. uh, I think she can, uh, yeah, we can be very confident going there. Better at eight years of age, it's uh, almost unthinkable, but she can do it. Oh, it's yeah, like and if you if you see her every day, the whole she is. Uh, Oh, when we first got her, you would have never thought she would last that long. And she's actually getting better. And I think, yeah, like I said, credit to the uh, to staff, our facilities, and she's just, yeah, just such a tough horse. Well done, Joe. Thank you. Congratulations, Willow. Well done, buddy. Thanks. What a fortnight you've had. Yeah, it's been amazing. Um, I, I, I know when I drove up here, to, actually, when I checked in at the Darling today at the Star, they said to me, or oh, Thursday, they said, welcome home. And I said, oh, it's getting a bit like that. And then someone else said, oh, are you from Sydney or from Melbourne? And I just said, well, look, I'm really lucky. I've got such a lovely horse in Ballard Patina. When we grew up dreaming about riding these races and then being an apprentice that you wouldn't believe on a derby day you'd find yourself up in Sydney but I've been up here for the last two years because of Bell and Ipatina. so these are special horses and I'm glad that people came out you've got Melbourne weather today but they got to see an amazing racehorse not only win one of the best or well, the richest turf race in the world in the Everest last time but to back it up today and show you how good she is she's an older mare but she just keeps getting better maybe not just the mare <laughs> well done buddy thanks very much Corey